Alright, welcome back to Fallout 4 today. We're gonna do tons of fun stuff, I'm sure. What's this guy doing? He's like messing with the workbench over here. It's the vault tech guy. Since we talked, I'm feeling swell. Look at the two of us here in Sanctuary. Prepared for the future. Alright, great. Anyway, sold all my stuff. He's happy, apparently. He's doing stuff with the workbench over there. I need to mess with my stupid mic. Make sure it's not stupid. It's probably still stupid. Alright, so what are we doing today? Uh, last time I wanted to go down here. We had to go down there for some reason. Uh, I guess it's to find the fucking mechanist or whatever the hell's stupid name is. So, might as well go to Sunshine Tidings and then go south. Or I could go here and go completely uh, west. I'm just gonna go here. Fuck it, let's go here. Doesn't really matter. I gotta walk one way or the other, so... Gotta walk one way or the other. Just depends. Do I want to walk south or do I want to walk west? Apparently, I want to walk west. I feel like changing my HUD colors a little bit. I don't know. I might go back to green. You know, make it make it feel like the old fallouts. Purple's all right. It's kind of weird. Been hanging with purple for a while. Might switch it to something else. Oh, that was nice. I mean, like I said before, some people were really impressed when I had the colors changed back in, like, Fallout 3. A surprising amount of people did not know that you could change some of the colors for, like... I don't know what you could change specifically, but I think you could change your, uh, your Pip-Boy colors. At the very least. I think it was kind of similar to this game. You could change... Uh, quite a few things, and a lot of people, a lot of people didn't know. A lot of people were like, how did he change the color of his fucking whatever it was? I was pretty surprised. Usually I'm the one who doesn't know stuff. Usually I'm the one who doesn't know, like, a hundred different things. Do I really have to climb, like, a... Great, what did you find? Let's see what you found. Come on. Go ahead and find it. Fuck it. He just barks. He just barks and, like... Every time he finds something, I Over don't here. even care. Like, every time he finds something, I couldn't give less of a shit. We got Fiddler's Gro- Oh, shit, what the fuck? I scared the shit. I scared the shit. I don't even want to fight these guys anymore. I get scared by, like, the stupidest shit, man. Especially in this game. Like, in this game. In this game, I've been getting scared by the stupidest stuff. How did he miss so many shots? I'm right next to him. I'm right next to this glowing one. I don't know why I lose that baseball. I've been scared like at least three or four times playing this game for no reason. I don't get it. I just I just wasn't expecting any any sort of crazy ghoul to come out. I thought I was safe. It's like they had a nice drug lab in here. In this trailer park. I don't know what they were doing here. Cook some drugs. You come out. You shoot some hoops. You go back inside. Cook some more drugs. And then you watch some TV. And then you go to bed. Perfect day. It's a perfect day. I don't even want to be using this gun. I got a new I got a new pistol. When I was doing my selling. Uh, here we go. My pistol volume too. I got a new pistol. It had like 25% extra damage on it. So I uh, I sold my other one when I was selling stuff, and then I modded this one. Man, sold my old one, modded this one, and now we got a new one. So I want to try this one out a bit. Help. I don't know <laughs> that cool didn't get up. I don't know what that cool was doing. Apparently, there's like nothing in here. All these trailers have been looted. All these trailers have apparently been looted. Uh, I don't know what that was. I don't know why ghouls would have this mo this area mined off. It's kind of weird. I guess they mined it off before they uh, turned into ghouls. That's my guess. That's my guess. 
barrel ghouls aren't too smart, so. Oh, there's a teddy bear with a the new squirrel tape three. Guess we'll play it. Some walking around stuff. Story time, Simon here with the exciting conclusion to the new squirrel. Yes. Tomorrow we. Oh yeah, 25% experience from persuading women. I love it. Give me that. This will never come in handy for me because I can never persuade women, whether it be in real life or uh, or Fallout. I can't persuade anyone in Fallout. I can't persuade anyone in real life. Never mind. I can't persuade anyone ever. So this magazine is essentially useless for me. Real life or uh, or otherwise. What else we got going on in here? This magazine's it's better than the melee damage ones, I guess. Got it. The melee the melee damage increase uh, never really does a lot for me because I don't melee anything. Let's see what's going on in this terminal. Apparently, I can just load a hollow tape, and that's it. All right, well, screw that. Take that stealth boy, that'll bring in a couple caps. Dog meat's in the way, as usual. I bet there's more tapes around here that you can listen to. I bet all this. Yeah, here's another one right here. Tape two. I'm listening to him out of order. Story time, Simon here. Fuck, Welcome I love back. story time, Simon. And here it is, part two of the new squirrel. One night, a red squirrel appeared at the bottom of Ricky's oak tree and woke Ricky and his family. Help me, said the red squirrel. I am lost and have nowhere to go. The elders were quick to turn the red squirrel away, but Ricky scurried down the trunk of his tree and stood firm next to the red squirrel. Yeah, what's going on? They're being mean to a red squirrel. What the fuck? Why would they do that? He yelled up at the elder squirrels. How could you turn him away? Just because he's from another tree, he needs our help. Affected by Ricky's assuredness and determination, the elders agreed to take in the Red Squirrel. The Red Squirrel thanked Ricky for standing up for him. You won't regret this, he said. End of holotape. Please insert holotape three. I'm just going to say this. The holotapes had a disappointingly, like, low amount of storage space on them. He... It was like a paragraph. He read a paragraph, and you already need the other holotape. I listened to them completely out of order. I found three, two, and one. I listened to them completely out of Hello. order. My name is Storytime Simon. Oh, yeah. Storytime Simon. I, I love Storytime like Simon. Because I love to tell stories. Yeah, me too. This one is called The New Squirrel. Come with me on this magical adventure. There once was a young squirrel named Ricky who lived in a big oak tree in a city park. Ricky was a brown squirrel and lived in the oak tree with all his brown squirrel friends and family. Every day, Ricky would look out from the top of his tree and wonder what kind of squirrels lived in other trees. The older squirrels warned Ricky that the squirrels in other trees were thieves. And no liars. way I could pick this. Oh, what? Master trusted. lock on a trailer? What? Ma oh, there's power armor in there. There's, yeah, there's power armor in there. There's a fucking master lock on this trailer. Some master locksmith was Locks living really in this strong. trailer park. Well, shit. I don't have. I don't have master lock picking. Well, I guess we're done here. Found a magazine, killed some ghouls, got some loot. Great. All right, there was a safe. Did I ever open that safe? Fuck, I walked right by that safe. I swear there was a safe around here somewhere. Now I gotta find it again. Why did I walk past it the first time? Oh, here it is. Did I open this? Sure didn't. Why would I walk right past the safe? That's it. Oh, I found I found the trailer key. It probably opens up the master lock. Well, perfect. White one. What could it be? Could be this. Cares is two. Is it an ES word? Jones. Man. It was an ES word. Totally was an ES word. Alright, well. I just wanted to do that for the little bit of experience. Dog meat's in the way again. Of course, dog meat's in the way. Let's see if we can open up this uh, this master lock trailer over here. Perfect. You got anything in here besides power? It looks like it just has power armor in here. 
There was like a soldier in here. What the fuck? Some soldier with like some ammo and I guess power armor just died in here for some reason. Alright, whatever. I mean, let's get in the power armor. Might as well use it for a while. I haven't used power armor like at all. Been a couple times where I've used power armor, but not not too many. Well, I think we're done here. We need to keep walking west. And maybe there's some other shit in these trailers. Who cares? It's probably just more ghoul garbage. And the question is, how do I walk west with this giant like? I'm gonna have to go over. I hate I hate the fucking like mountains and shit, like the big ass hills and fallout. New Vegas was the worst. I got stuck by like a giant mountain range or whatever the hell it was for like ever. I always get lost in New Vegas. I don't know why. Where the fuck are we? I don't know where we're at. It's another random city. Doesn't even have like a map mark, does it? Have oh, at Fort Hagen. Found Fort Hagen. And do I really not have a light that's on? Oh, this the soldier died with a Jangles the Moon Monkey. Dog meat found something. I don't even care what dog meat found. Fuck dog meat. Every time dog meat finds something, I go over to him and then he just sits there barking at me. Oh, what? Why, what is that? He brought me a pool cue. I think he brought me a pool cue. Why the fuck would I care about a pool cue? Dog meat, your priorities are all over the place. It's ridiculous. A battered clip. Oh, pre-war money. So much pre-war money in this game. Armor workbench. I don't even have one of these back at the old, uh, what do you call it? I can't do that while in power armor. Perfect. Glad I can't do that while in power armor. I do need to. I do need to mod my armor at one point. I haven't modded my armor. I don't know. All right, we found Fort Hagen filling station. Apparently, we can turn this into a settlement. There's like a power armor station here. There's uh, an armor workbench. Probably some other stuff around here. The direct problem is, is that I don't really care about making a settlement. <laughs> I really don't care, so I'm not going to do it. Apparently we had a bunch of barracks here. Makes sense. It is Fort Hagen or whatever. Might as well just loot all this stuff. Oh, what the... Blood bugs! Come on, blood bugs. Nobody likes a blood bug. I can't even shoot it. Oh, I hit it. I hit three times out of four. I guess that's, it's alright. Oh, do blood bugs kill everyone here? I mean, besides the bomb. I mean, the bomb probably. Oh, there's scavengers here, too. How'd these scavengers die? Must have been the blood bugs. Oh, man, why did I take that moldy food? Why would I want moldy food? Oh, there's got to be something neat around here, right? A couple houses we can maybe go into. That one looks closed off. Closed off? Oh, they're all closed off, it looks like. Except this one. This one seems all right. Hmm, very interesting house here. Yep, uh, yep. Very interesting, all right. Let's keep moving. <laughs> There's nothing in there. It was just dilapidated. It was completely fucked. This looks pretty important. Look at this place. This place right here. Oh, there's a tank back here. What? They got a fucking tank back here. Doesn't look like it's in working order, but they got a tank. I'd be kind of scared. My guess is that we just have to go in that building there. 